island of Watachi. There was a boy who was walking through the beach one day when he came upon three miniature-sized coconuts. He picked up the coconuts, he threw them in the air, and they hit the ground. So I picked them up once more. He threw them in the air, and he caught them. And this is how juggling began. Stop! For juggling to continue, you must sacrifice one member into the fiery pit of the volcano. So the boy knew what he had to do. Oh, I'm hoping, all right. I'm hoping. <laughs> and I'm also hoping you like our next act, the Flying Fettuccini Brothers. Fettuccini? Well, you're not a piece of bad ravioli yourself. those jugglers troops and how about this great USO band huh wonderful wonderful ah, well troops
our strength. Without the spirit monkey, our powers to juggle would be non-existent. Then it takes me. I've concocted a truly evil scheme. What is it, boss? I'm going to steal the spirit monkey. <laughs> <laughs>
Well, Pete, looks like it's time to take out the trash. I couldn't agree more, Joey. Hey, Joey, hmm. found plunger. It looks pretty clean. I wonder why someone threw it. Whoa! Ugh, no wonder I threw it out. It smells horrible. What? I don't see anything wrong with it. Uh... Hey, Joey! <laughs> I found two more plungers. Uh, maybe you'll like it. What? Oh, boy! We gotta change these into something. Well, you know, to stay consistent with the theme. The what? Nothing! Ugh, uh, maybe you'll like this one too. What? No, no, I don't want your, your stinky plungers. Don't dump this on me. Don't dump this on me, Joey. Uh, here. Hey, come on! Oof. Hey! Hey, Joey! Yeah! I found three of our plungers. How convenient. Mm. Hey, I've got an idea with what we could do with these. Yeah. Why don't we pass them back and forth? Hmm. We'll call it the gravity defying juggling pattern with plungers of Verlitterschmetterling. I like that, Joey. It's simple yet elegant. <sighs> hey, hey, yep. You know, Pete, this has got to be worse than juggling knives. Why do you say that, Joey? Well, at least if you catch a knife with the wrong end, well, your hand comes off. Yeah. Wait, Joey. Huh? I got a great idea. A great idea. We'll do the same exact pattern. We'll do the fleet to deep to deep turn. Times two. Times two. Yes, twice as fast. Twice, twice as hard. hard. You ready, Joey? No. Hey, hey up. up. Oh, and apparently twice as smelly. Uh, uh. I caught the wrong end! Ah, come uh. up, come up. Okay. Anyway, we have to elevate this act to a whole new level. What act? Nothing. Anyway, let's raise the bar on this by three feet, five inches. Are you insinuating oh, that way? Oh, not just insinuating. We'll call it the gravity-defying juggling pattern with blunders on trash cans of Philippe de Schmetterling. Butterfly in love. Hey, Joe, you ever play kick the can when you're a little kid? Can't say that I have. Have any friends that do? No, not really. Good. Mm. <laughs> Who's got the plungers now? Ha uh ha. -huh. <sighs> you know what? This V show isn't big enough for the two of us. The what show? Nothing. <laughs> a duel. Five paces. It's on Joe. One, two, three, four, five, six, six, five. five. Bing. You're going down, Joey. Freestyle. It's time to die. Whoa. <laughs> 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 Nothing? <laughs> oh, I'm bored. What do you want to do? I don't know. Let's go. We can't. Why not? Waiting for the punchline. Oh, right, right. <laughs> That's a punchline! <laughs>
I'm here with Shannon Bergie, who's juggling in both South Side Story and Mayhem this year in Variety Show. Shannon, can you tell us a little bit about these acts? Well, South Side Story is a lot of fun. We're using beach balls and leaf blowers, which is difficult, but very entertaining, and it gives a good effect. And Mayhem is a whole bunch of jugglers doing all kinds of tricks all at the same time, so it's a whole bunch of action. It's a lot of fun. Shannon, this has been your first year in Variety Show. What's it been like? It's been fun so far. There's a lot of practice, but I like it so far, and I hope the show's going to be really good. Scott, what's it like being in the Variety Show this year? Oh, I'm having a great time, and I'm just glad that I got the chance to do this, and it's fun being one of the few freshmen in it, so uh, it's a great time.
In ancient times, people lived without fire. They ate cold food without cooking it. They also had no warmth. Prometheus, one of the gods, did not see this as fair. Prometheus decided to give fire to humans, even though he did not have permission. Zeus, the king of all gods, was not happy. He punished Prometheus by making the beautiful Pandora to tempt him. Down on Earth, everybody was happy. Everybody was happy. Humans knew nothing bad, so their lives were as peaceful as ever. They spent their days frolicking in the sun and enjoying their lives. One day, Pandora was just wandering around when a box appeared. Pandora was surprised and stared at the box. Eventually, the messenger god, Hermes, popped out of the box. Hermes handed Pandora a key, but told her with extreme caution, do not open this box. Pandora listened, but only for about five minutes. She put the key in the box and opened it. Pandemonium broke loose. First came death, who brought out disease. After disease came hunger, and all other evil popped out one by one. Once the box appeared to be empty, Pandora looked inside. Out came one last thing, hope. Hope promised that even though all of these things would cause despair among mankind, she would forever give them the strength to carry on. Pandora was grateful to Hope and decided to go off on her merry way. Hope, on the other hand, well... Adam, can you stop that, please? Cool. Ah, lack of spirit wiped out. Now, where was I? Oh, yeah. <gasps> bum, bum, bum. Ba -ba -da, da -da -da. Batman, I am going to get you. No, no, you won't. Hey, Shelly. <sighs> the Diablo's missing. What am I going to do? Hmm. <laughs> well, he's all I got.
finally got the Diablo. Now I'm gonna go scrub it up and make it clean for Doc Shower. <gasps> it's a fake! Those kids!
Hey, guys, look. They like that. Scott, you aren't supposed to talk. This is a variety show. Jugglers don't talk here. But we're talking right now, and it goes with the theme of chaos. Stop! Everyone knows that if the jugglers talk during variety show, we'll <gasps> drop. No, we won't. Watch this. I'm talking. Whoa! I'm talking and I'm juggling. I'm talking and I'm juggling and I'm not dropping. Ha ha. Whoa. Cool. Let me try. Let me try. I'm juggling and I'm talking and I'm. Everyone hates me. Yeah, they do. It's okay, Tapo. It's okay. You can always be a mime. Hey guys, look. I think we can do this. You trust me? Sure, sure we, we do. do. Trust, trust all. all. Okay. Psych! <laughs> guys, why don't we all try to talk and juggle at the same time? I don't know. That could get complicated. I'm chewing gum. <laughs> but, 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 come on, guys. It's my senior year. And Nate's too. Do it for me and Nate. But, but, uh, Nate, please. Or just do it for me. Okay. okay. Trust fall. This talking while juggling is kind of cool. Yeah, look, we're not dropping. Shh. Hey, did the costume lady downstairs make you guys put on lipstick? Yeah. yeah. Did you like it? No. no. Oh, me neither. <laughs> hey, juggler. Hey, so Soman, why are you wearing a dress? Because you told me to wear a nice dress yesterday. Nice dress? Yeah. No, Soman, I said dress nice. Oh. <laughs> dress nice, nice dress. Isn't that the same thing? No. But anyway, the audience loves you. Um, I don't think so. Because if they loved me, wouldn't they be clapping for me? <laughs> What exactly is chaos? Well, Scott, the name chaos theory comes from the fact that the systems in which the theory are discussed are apparently disordered. But chaos theory is really about finding underlying order in apparently random data, like blood vessels branching out further and further. So what you're saying, Nate, is physics is no longer just the study of subatomic particles in a billion dollar particle accelerator, but also the study of chaotic systems and how they work. Exactly. I don't know, Rob. I don't know, Rob. I think Somong looks kind of good in a dress. Phil, our mics are back on. Hey guys, um, what you talking about? Nothing. Nothing. Okay, let's do another pattern. Hey, do you guys remember back in the old juggling days where everyone just ran around going crazy and then they eventually ended up in their spot? Yeah. 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 Could we try that? Sure. Okay. Yeah, why not? All right, one, two, three. Ah! Maybe not. Freshman. Hey, Nate, do you think we can try that pattern where we pass doubles of our shoulder to each other and I pass the squirt and tapple standing three meters apart, passing every other double downs on the odd throw? And then Phil, Robbie, and I are doing the same thing on the other side except backwards? No, we could never do that. We just did it! <laughs> How do you know? Your time is almost up. All right, guys, if our time is almost up, we have to end with something awesome. Something so cool that we'll receive a standing ovation. I got this one. Ta-da! Superstar! I was kidding! <laughs> Come on, guys, huddle up. I got the trick. Hey, so long. We're gonna need an extra club for this one. We're doing seven. Seven, 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 three, two, one, break! <laughs> Big finish.
Stage one of Fee Show Takeover complete. Stage secure. How's it going, Phil? <laughs> Stage two complete. Sound booth secure. Status report. Uh, I got the mics. I got the lights. And I have Mr. Wojcik's baton. The pit won't be bothering us anymore. I got the ladders. Ladders? Uh, thanks, thanks so much. No problem. Well, now that we've taken over V-Show, we can juggle for as long as we want. Hey, yo. Um, catchthisjuggling.com? Guys, I don't think this is what they came to see. Okay, so right, I guess you're right. 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 I got it. So you can fill the pit with water and put a diving board on there and go swimming naked. I was kidding. Let's just pass. Good idea. How are we going to pass with Robert? He's too tall. Maybe you're too short. Maybe you're too stupid. You all right? <laughs> you guys, my voice of wisdom is telling me that these ladders were brought here for a reason. Jousting! Nay, 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 nay. God, you guys, quit horsing around. Oh. Oh. You guys are swimming without me? I'll go get naked. No, 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 wait, no, wait, no. Guys, 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 why don't we, why don't we just juggle? Wish it number one. Wish no, number one. Number one. Number one. Number one. Number one. Number one. Ready? Everybody in their line? Right, here we go. Hey. 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 Oh. That was a close one. Yeah. Yeah. It's okay. There we go. Juggling style. Feeding Jitsu. Hey, Jared. How's it going? Good. So, do you want to? Do you like the jugglers today? Yeah. So you want to learn how to juggle too? Okay. Okay. Here we go. Ah! ah, 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 ah. So, Mug, were you just talking to a plastic flamingo? No. <laughs> Look, Robert, a stage crew member got loose. Go get him. So, Mug, go help. Roar. So, Mug, what position? Push number two, go! Number two, number two! Where's the man? Let's go! Number two, number two! Number three? Definitely not number one. No, no, not number three. All right, come on. Soma, now that we're backstage, did you see that blonde girl waving at me? She was hot. Oh, you mean the girl in the fifth row? Yeah. Dude, she was waving at me, not at you. Are you serious? We made eye contact. Dude, she's my sister. Oh. Never mind. Okay, I think we should get out there right now. They're like looking at us. Let's go. Okay. Position number three! Position, Position number, number three. three! Number three! Ah! Number three! Ah! Okay! okay. Ah! 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 Hi, Mom. Aren't you like three, supposed to be in there too? Two, oh! One. Juggling pairs looks cool, three, right? But well, I know two, what's missing. Ta-da! Three, two, mm. one. Three, two, one. Last pass. You know, guys, considering we don't have any staging or lighting or crew experience, this is going pretty well. Yeah, I mean, what does the stage crew do anyway? Well, they kind of built this whole set. Forget that, we can do it ourselves. Yeah! yeah. Using angle side side. And alternate interior angles are congruent. Everyone knows A squared plus B squared equals C squared. Guys, don't forget that south of the equator, the drains run the other way. That's helpful. Hey, Phil, where'd you go to college? Dennis Modern, Modern art. art. Thank you. Hey, Stitch Crew's back! Ah! Ah! Guys, where are you guys going?
as we explore the juggling act, Secrets Revealed. Hi, I'm Tim. I'm the freshman. Normally I'm in a subservient role to the upperclassmen and bring them whatever they want, like balls, clubs, or king-sized Whopper meals from Burger King. I'm a freshman. What's up, guys? I'm Neil. I'm the good-looking senior. Well, I don't juggle that well, but wow, you want to good! <laughs> I'm Will. I wear the dress. Not because I want to, but because I want to be in V-Show. Hi, Mom. Hi, I'm Pierce. I'm the quiet guy who delivers all of his lines in a monotone. I have trouble expressing myself. Look at me. I'm enthused. <laughs> I'm a robot, but I juggle better than most. I'm Julie. I'm a girl. Traditionally, there are no girls in juggling act. Therefore, this is the last you'll see of me. I'm Robert. I'm the best juggler. <laughs> I actually don't go to school here. I'm just hired for the show. <laughs> And they don't pay very well. Hi, I'm Joe. I'm the narrator. I can't really juggle at all, but I come up with all our ideas. Like, hey, you guys, imagine a lone club wandering through a manic field of juggling. See? It's that easy. The script? Wait, we have a script? I didn't hear about any script. Did you write a script? You guys never told me we needed a script. I can't work under these conditions. Robert, out. I guess we could use a little more direction in this act. Good point. Hey, let's just make it up as we go along. Okay. Hey, yup. Well, this is basic club juggling in a line. It's not too difficult if you know how to juggle clubs, but it sure looks cool. Cool. Hey, guys, do I still have to wear the dress? The joke is dead by now. Do you still want to be in V-Show? Well, yeah, but... Well, then the size four stays. I hate you guys. Position number two. How do we get there? Usually we just run around screaming and be up in the right spot. <laughs> Old joke. 
Now, some of you these show regulars have probably realized that we incorporate some form of this pattern every year. So this year, we've decided to subtly break the monotony with the addition of this dummy. Cool. <laughs> pattern number four. <laughs> so, Mom? Sometimes we heighten our juggling effects with the addition of really great juggling music. Hit it. Time it is. It's time for the big finish. Oh my god, yes! That's the magic man! Oh my god! Yeah, the magic man. What do you got for us? I got a card trick for you, and I don't know if you're going to be able to see this, right? But... Oh, my, I'm on the way. Oh, put the food on the Yeah! Okay. Alright, all I want you to do is um, pick any card you want. Uh, no, no. Yeah, 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 do you guys see this? Show yeah, 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 yeah. everyone yeah. and the people at home. Right? Uh, you memorize the card? Yeah. Okay. Uh, place it back. Okay. I'm just going to um, place the rest on top, and I'm going to snap just like that. Okay. And I should have made your card turned over, which is that. No. Wait, is that your card? No, it's not my card. It's not? No. Oh, you know what? That's actually an indicator card. It indicates to me how many cards it is from the top. So if we ah. count one, two, three, four, and here's the fifth card. No way! Oh, wait, 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 hold on, 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 hold on. Um, not only I found your card um, from this five, but it was right next to the four aces. What? Oh, oh, you do that? How did you do that? How is it even possible? No way! How did he do that? How did he do that? I'm scared. I am Ring Man. I am Club Girl. I am Plunger. Man. I am Knife Man. And I am Rumble Man. Everybody, rumble. Together we form the, the League, League of Incredible Jugglers. <laughs> we give it incredible jugglers. It is I, your arch nemesis, Mean Bean. Dun dun dun! <gasps> Not Mean Bean! Dun dun dun! You put me away for years, but I found a way to escape and found a way to take away your ability to juggle. And now I'm gonna take over the world. <laughs> Quick, <laughs> <level> man, stop <laughs> it! Everybody, run! We've lost our abilities to juggle. I guess we're back to plunging toilets. But who's going to stop? Mean Bean! Dun dun dun! We're not defeated yet. Ring Man, you have a plan? Yes, when Mean Bean. Dun dun dun! Just stop that. Took away our abilities to juggle. He forgot about the power of the ring. Now that I've restored your abilities to juggle, jugglers, grab your equipment. Power of the knife!
It seems you have regained your power to juggle. Quick, juggle, you're sitting with all we've got. 